Hi folks, Stephen Marinoski from Smart Technologies. Uh, when you're running meetings with Smart Teamworks, we understand that you might have confidential meetings where you don't want to have any information or residual left over from those meetings when you're done. We also understand and, and uh, look at that we need to support people who want to continue on previously saved meetings or have ongoing collaboration uh, with, uh, with their whiteboards. And we're able to support both of those with Teamwork Server. So according to your own company's policy, you set what it is that you need to do by room. Uh, what I want to walk you through is an example where we just walked out of a different room, uh, where I was with my colleague Fraser, and we were working on a meeting. And what I wanted to do was walk into here and connect to this previously saved session. So I bring up on my Teamworks app on my phone, I'm able to bring up my previously saved session, and I'm able to use ultrasonic pairing as I walk into this room in order to bring it up uh, onto Teamworks and for us to continue on our collaboration. So as we're bringing up, we're in a live session, and as you can see, we're able to continue on with what our previously saved whiteboard and content was and uh, uh, continue on our collaboration. So thank you very much.